kila wakati muombe Mungu. Shukuru Mungu kwa kile kidogo. Unaweza kuwa unachukua labda unafanya kazi unapata pesa kidogo. Unaanza kuhesabu nitafanya namna gani? Mshukuru Mungu kwa kile kidogo. Unapomshukuru Mungu, atakuzidishia ata zaidi. Mtegemee Mungu kila wakati. Kuna wengine hawana kabisa. Kabisa hawana. Mtu anashindwa atanzia wapi? Lakini mshukuru Mungu kwa kile kidogo ambacho unapata. Hata tunapoona uchumi umezidi kuwa juu. At least mzozo zetu zote zina. Mungu si anakipenda. Hata kama umeenda juu, at least unapata kitu yaweka kwa meza. Hata kama ni chai peke yake, unapata kitu yaweka kwa meza. Maana Mungu hawezi kutuacha. Yuko nasi kila wakati na anatupigania. Mungu yuko. Unaweza kwa labda unanisoma Sometimes. Sabu kuna tajet ambayo tena shetani wanga na tajet. 
Kuna nila ombi ambayo unapenda unapenda kuomba, unafanya ombi kila wakati. Na kuna mama ambayo unapenda kuyatamka yale ya kwanza ambayo anaanza nayo. Shetani anajua, unajua shetani ako very trick, anajua yule anapoomba anaomba gani. So anajua. Ana zile ana zile zile mbinu ambazo anajua. So sometimes unapoomba, omba na hata ukabadilisha yale maombi at least ya tuwe advance kiasi. Ukamtukuze uka, uka Mungu kwa sababu kingine cha hali ya juu. Shetani anajua hapa ni kubaya. Huyu mtu ni mwombezi. Ame na uhuri katika kiwango chake cha cha mwombezi. Na utapata na kuacha pole pole, lakini ukiendelea na ile ombi lako through out ni kwa flat kila wakati. Shetani anajua na tutajeje yake kwa. Anajua kwa anaomba hivi. Hata akimaliza atamaliza hivi. So sometimes advance katika maombi yako. Na unapotamka maana tamka kitu ambacho unataka. Tamka kile kitu ambacho Mungu anataka mtu akupe. Na atakutendea. Mungu yuko na anazidi kuchukua. Anatupigania, anatushindania. Hata hata tuacha kama. Maana sisi ni sisi ni watoto wake anatupenda. Ndio tunaambia kwamba Mungu hapa ya mabungu yote. Tafika mahali unajikuta umekuchukia. Kwa nini? Kwa sababu Mungu anakupigania katika imani yako na katika kumuomba kila wakati. Utapata umebadilika, maisha yamebadilika, kila kitu kimeanza kubadilika. Kutumainia Mungu. Yuko na wewe kila wakati na atakushindania. Ukaweza kubarikiwa. Amen. That's so powerful. I like that. Na amesema EP ya leo anakuwa pasta. Epu pigia pasta makofi mazuhu. Kwa na spesa. That is wonderful. That is so great. Na kweli si amekuwa pasta. Si amefanikiwa. Mwambi jirani hata kesho bini nitakuwa pasta. <laughs> na nitasimama kulipua. Amen. Kwa na spesa. Now, when you look at this uh, message and the connect with the first message about Likwanayo Kasubui wale ambao walitangulia hapa utakundua this message is one <laughs> when you look at this message and connect with the first message kwa wale walikuwa hapa utakundua the message is one so wakati ya mekuja tena ameleta ujumbe mzuri sana about restoration katika somo la kwanza tulimaliza tukisema hii God is restoring you permanently wana suwe sana God is restoring permanently tulimalizia pari God is restoring you Permanently. Hiyo ilikuwa kitabu gani? Unajua kuna wale hawakukua. Mtu alikumbuje kama mtajo. God is restoring you permanently. Hiyo msali tulisoma ilikuwa gani? Asubuhi wale walikuwa hapa. Kai ni wewe unaandika hizi. How can you forget such a powerful scripture? Sure. God is restoring me permanently. Can I forget that? Ukicha kwa Biblia yangu nikipatana na mstari nzito kama hiyo ninaweka lines hata wakati mwingine naandika hapo tarehe sasa nikiomba na kumbuka kuna kumbuka Mungu tarehe fulani asubuhi through your servant Benjamin uliniambia I'm restoring you permanently so wakati nataka kuja na rudi hapo nataka kunasema God you say it bwana asubuhi sana wakati shida inataka kuja na rudi pale you and you say it to me you are restoring permanently I use this problem because told how it works. Yes. We do live by faith in the things of God. In the word of God. At the same time, I'm restoring you permanently. Yes. I'm restoring you permanently. Now, I can't tell my answer. I was very happy. I can see you at the Buddha for a figure. I'm the same as you. I'm the same as you. I'm the same as you. I'm the same 1827 mimi naandika wao yatika kwa bwana huyu kwa mechi na naona huyu bwana asubuhi sana ni basi ni tu you need to write these things powerful scriptures kama hizo imagine Luke 1827 anasema what is impossible with people is possible with god hiyo na 
mwe sasa hawa aje. Tasopa wasu bana sasa. Amen. Hiyo naandika tena naandika hata mara mbili. Bana sasa. Yasiyowezekana kwa wanadamu yanawezekana kwa Mungu which means hakuna jambo lisiyowezekana. Kila kitu inawezekana ukita kwa Mungu kila kitu inawezekana. Amen. God and understand luka moja inaitwa possibilities vitu impossible ni kwa watu akamwambia Zerubabel what is this that you are seeing before you bwana siwe sana amen and i want to ask a question that what is this that you are seeing before you na akamwambia Zerubabel itakuwa inji tambarali people of god bwana siwe sana itakuwa in other words i'm going to fight for you i'm going to remove all the, 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 the obstacles sasa wewe utaenda inchi kiwa tambarani you will not struggle bwana siwe sana god is restoring you permanently god is restoring you permanently amesoma kitabu ya joy eish mumesikia hiyo kweli hata niliweka pale kwa ubao yetu mliona Joel alikuwa anasema nini Anasoma kitabu ya Joel kitabu hiko People of God write down these things How can I miss that When you miss that you miss everything Bwana siwe sana Hey Alafu tuwe tunakuja na ngoma Usimwambie jirani Mukuse kidogo mwambie jirani Mkuse kana kidogo mwambie jirani It is to come with God Because wengine tunaweza kusikosa Unajua sio siku zote unaweza pata such a big scriptures Mimi usikiza 
Usikiza. Sipotezi. And I thank God because of that letter. Sipotezi. Nikitaka kurudilia yota. Because in a, in a kamata kabisa na hile ingine na andika. That is why nataka wewe pio kwe kama vini. Mwambi chalani kwe kama pasta. Kuna kamata kila kitu. Hakuna kitu na potea. Mwambi chalani kwanzia leo. Auda potesa chuchote. Pasta amesema. Na roa mungu aluweka mhuri. Roa ya kusau yende kapisa. Mwambie. Mwambie na madumadu madumadu waliokuja kula mali yenu ehe na tunutu na tunutu sasa sikiliza kwa makini fungua sikio kidogo tufanye hivi fanye hivi maybe sikia skip so fanye fanye to just kidogo fanye fanye eh ina sikia mzuri sasa eh sasa soma soma sasa sikiliza jeshi langu kubwa ni lilo lituma kati yetu sikiliza hilo lilikuwa ni jeshi la Mungu Adilo lituma katikati yetu. Ni mungu aliruhusu ilo jesi liche. Likule. Akijua kuna wakati anakuja kurejesha. Hakutuma ilo jesi kula ili uwe masikini hapana. Alituma ikule yondoe umujue akikuja kurejesha ana ili isije kama ya kwamba sasa unajizifu ili nguvu yangu unajua ile kitu ndio Mungu anafanya because akiruhusu wende hivyo utafika mahali unasema you know what mm-hmm. so powerful na Mungu ataki mwendeje Mungu ataki Mungu ataki Mungu ataki majivuno Mungu ataki majivuno ukitaka kujivuna you come down ukitaka kujivuna you come down Yes. Kuliza jirani kama amesikia. Yes. Yes. Bwana siweza. Yes. Sasa usisababishe Mungu atumane zike parale na tunutu. Hiyo ni jeshi ya Mungu kuleta discipline. Hiyo <laughs> ni jeshi ya nani? Ya Mungu. Mwenyewe amesema jeshi langu ndilo lituma kwenu. Likuje nilete discipline. Bwana siweza. Yes. Lakini halileti discipline ya kuharibu. something for the purpose of restoring you. Bwana asiwe sana. Anafanya kwa sababu ya ya kukurejesha mbili ya mbili. Mbili ndio ya. Bwana asiwe sana. Anafanya for the purpose of restoring you. And that is why last Sunday I told you this. Wakati wa sickness ya Lazarus, what did Jesus say? He said, "Hii ugonjwa si wa mauti." Mwana wa Mungu ukuzwe kupitia hii. But people could not understand. Bwana asiwe sana. The challenge you are passing through. That small problem that you are passing through, it is not meant to destroy you. It is meant to give God the glory. Bwana asiwe sana. You are testimony is big chance. Because how will you testify without a challenge? How will you stand to declare the greatness of God without a challenge? Look at Job. Job is standing in the cup declaring the greatness of God but I have seen a challenge. Bwana asiwe sana. Job number 42 verse 1 and 2. The Bible says Job is declaring now Job have and have witnessed the goodness of God and I'm here to declare that sure what God has in our lives no man can ever change it and i'm here to tell you this kila mungu alikusudia maizani mwako can you speak to yourself ukishika kifua chako kila mungu alikusudia maishani mwangu sema kila mungu alikusudia maishani mwangu hakuna mtu atapendua hakuna mtu atapendua hakuna pe- 
Hakuna itapendua Hakuna shetani atapendua Hakuna uchao itapendua Lazima itimilike kwa jina la Yesu Christ Lazima itimilike kwa jina la Yesu Christ If you believe that clap your hands to God Because now God is shaking it with the wrath of some of the Holy Spirit. And you will live ukiona ikitendeka. Amen. Bwana sikuwe sana. Amen. If that we talk just with that in Zimbabwe. It's so powerful. Bwana sikuwe sana. Amen. Alafu amemaliza kitabu kingine hapa. Hebu angalieni hapa mara kwa screen. Ile kitabu amemaliza naye na hivyo nishangaze kaniache kile basi. Umesoma hivi uzuri kweli? Looking away from all that will distract us and focusing our eyes on Jesus, who is the author and perfecter of faith. Who is the author and perfecter of our faith? Because he is the perfecter. The perfecter will make sure that it is done. Na ndiyo sababu tunarudi kwa ile kitabu yetu ya kwanza ya asubuhi. Permanently. He will do it permanently. Because he is the perfecter. Bwana sikuwe sana. He will do it permanently. He will do it permanently. You will not struggle again. Your property will never be destroyed. He is bringing you back again. He is restoring you back again. Hapa katikati yetu kuna usuda mzito sana. Ni vile daima ijapika. Daima ikifika mtashanga. Amen. Hapa katikati kuna usuda mzito sana. God is restoring you. Mari yako haita potea. Hakuna kiki itakula. Hakuna tunudu. Hakuna parare. Watakula. Mari yako yoga itakua restored. Mari yako mungu atalinda. Na yeyota atakaye kuza. Ata ingia kwa shiko yoga. Wakati wame relaxu na oji tibi. Mali yako itakuwa protected Hakuna kitu itakuza Because when God is restoring He cannot allow Vitu zako tena kupotea That you have Mungu wa mekupatia Haita potea Hata wezi wakikuja kuipa Wadachanganikiwa watapatwa pare pare Hawata toka Sisi atutaki kuenda kutafuta dawa ya watu kukula nyasi Habana Mungu wa naingia kwa nafika Hapo na nachanganikiwa na nabaki Hatoki Unakuja kupata Kale kale Siku moja mutu wakachukua Kamera yangu Kwa kila mali tunafundisha One of my students Kamera Ya kupika picha Nikauliza wanafuzi Na ya nichukua kamera hapa Kila mutu wakasema hakuna mutu hakuna mutu hakuna Nikawambia bimi kitu zangu wa sikotei Na ukitaka kujua Hasikotei basi kaa na yofanyia kazi matani Kumoja tukiwa Tukiwa kwa judge on Sunday Mutu wakaena Haka pea asha Unone kanda Peneke ule pasta kwa kapu Na haka toroka kapisa kwa kapu So sisi tukiwa hapo tukawana Kanda ni inaripa paka kwa mesu Nani ya meleta? Hatujui Hameenda wapi? Hatujui Na sisi ya tukuwa na haja na heye Si kamera iko hapa Tuwe muende kumutafuta tusaige na miku Are you hearing what I'm saying? Hii likuja hapo hapo tumeketi Na hakuna kamuti Hakuna chuchote Neema ya mungu Tunatumana roa mungu tu anarest Tuwe mungu maali ya liku Mwana sikuwe sana Anarest yeye maali ya liku Anakosa amani kapisa 
mpaka hiyo kamera kitaweku kupiga mtu pija anaona pija ya pasta hapo sema hapana hii kitu akijaribu kuangalia apige haoni yule mtu anaona pasta bwana sume sana god is restoring you prevalence don't fear anything God is restoring you only if you believe. Amen. Thank you very much for bringing the word of experience. Because of time in Gendere, like in time we make it. Tuombe. Bwana Yesu nasema, because you are restoring your church. You are